good morning, good afternoon, or whatever time you're watching this, hello, welcome to today's video. Uh, today's video is going to be day number three of my epic European road trip. Without further ado, roll titles. <laughs> Uh, today's going to be one of those days where yesterday I was in the Netherlands, which I've been to before quite a few times. Today I'm still here in Germany, which I was actually here last week. <laughs> um, but today I'm going to Czechia, which is a completely new place. I've never been to Czechia before. Before I left, I had a guy called Neil, a friend of mine, who did the whole service for my car. Because he'd done all that, I said I'd write his name on the car. Um, and as you can see, there's no sign of Neil Dobson written on this car, and I feel guilty. So <laughs> all I found, I can't find paint. Can't find anywhere it says paint. I'm literally going to engrave his name into my car. So Neil, if you're watching this, I'm now physically engraving your name into my car. I'm now leaving the campsite. Thank you, Strat Stad Stad Captain Schweinfurt. Okay, welcome to day number three. What a complete other club it was. Seat will be on a curtain. Okay, today we are heading for Czech, Czechia, Czechia, formerly known as Czech Republic. Sat nav is on. We've got 444 kilometres, which in English is going to be for 283 miles. I'm just having my breakfast. Today's breakfast is Nutella. Be squash. Nutella. Be ready. Available in multi-pack. Okay, we are now at a petrol station. I am currently 201 kilometers away, which I'm going to go with 120, 125 miles. Um, we'll quickly stop here to get some fuel. These roads in Germany, now I've got a little bit further down, or across, or down, whatever you want to call it. They're amazing. I mean, just look at this road. Currently sitting in the sun here, it is 32 degrees. You see that? I've had the windows wide open to let some air come in, and just sitting in the sun without moving, it's now climbed up to 42 degrees. <coughs> oh, it's hot! I'm going to have to uh, move on, I'm going to have to keep moving, get some air in. In a few hundred yards we will be approaching the Czechia border. Oh, that's it. Oh, really? There is the Czech border. Ladies and gentlemen, we are now officially in Czechia. I've got to say, Czech. Uh, you're definitely by far the best country for a picture. Welcome to Czechia. These roads just get better and better. Check this out. Okay, we have multiple cameras set up. We've got one on the back, which is the view here. We've got one on the side door, which is this view here. And we've got one facing the front, which is this view here. Made a bit of a mistake. As you can see here, is a perfectly good petrol station. Yeah, the reason I've stopped here is because I need to get some fuel in my car. However, when pulling in, I saw a sign that said uh, prices. You can see there, it says 31.50. Uh, that confused me a little bit because 31.50 
doesn't really make any sense because it's not 31 euros 50 per litre. So I've had a look online and basically, because now we're in Czechia, they don't actually accept the euro. They use their own currency. Now 29 minutes away from um, a European, well not European, but a petrol station accepts euro. I'm now going to have to drive half an hour back away from where I need to be. Ah. Believe it or not, this is actually two lanes. Um, I believe I'll get past the Canada, but the lanes are ridiculously small. Come in. further into Czechia and it's basically Czechia goes along like this and then Austria peaks its little head over and then Czechia continues this way. So I'm going to drive right up to the border of Austria so I'll still stay in Czechia so I'm still continuing with what I said. However if I do need petrol I can then just cross the border, go into Austria, get some petrol in Austria in Euros and then pop back up the other side back into Czechia. I am visiting Austria, but not later on until the trip. I'm going to the bottom of Austria. Yep, boy! and check. So I had to guess roughly how much I put in. I put in 68, 68 check money which worked out at 26 euros so yeah I've got it pretty spot. So I didn't actually leave check here. I'm literally like 3.3 kilometers away from the border. So I was very close but I didn't actually quite leave it. So I'm still in check here and hopefully the fuel that I now have in my car will last me all the way through Czechia until I get to Slovakia the day after. Fingers crossed. I've made it back to where I was. This up here, there. That's the petrol station I was at. So I'm now any second now. Now, I'm further into Czechia than I was half an hour ago. Anyway. Look at these roads, they're still beautiful, I'm still having a great time. So that's pretty much the end of day number three. I'm safe and sound in Czechia. My car's nice and safely parked up. I'm going to spend the night here. So that's pretty much it. So until tomorrow, when I'm driving from here, Czechia, to Slovakia, it's time to say... Oops, that's really shaky. It's time to say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs>